Hi guys! Today we are going to be making a very simple resin project, which are going to be these bottle cap charms or magnets. I'm going to be using Easy Cast Resin, which comes with a bottle of resin and some hardener. It comes with a lot of instructions that you should read through before using. Easy Cast performs best at 24 degrees, so I'm putting the bottles in some warm water and leaving them for 5 to 10 minutes. You can use any cute pictures for this project, but I like to use stickers, especially these bunny ones because they have really funny expressions. I collected a bunch of bottle caps from my cousin's parties back in China, and you'll need two containers and a popsicle stick. I'm also going to be using washi tape and stickers for some of the background, but paper would also work fine. To make the background, just trace the bottle cap with a pencil and cut out the circle. Make sure it can fit into your bottle cap. My stickers were kind of translucent, so I decided to stick them on paper first and then cut them out. You can use washi tapes as backgrounds by taping two strips together on a piece of waxy paper and then peeling them off together as one circle. I really like this little bunny with an umbrella. It's so cute! Oh my gosh, this chubby one eating is so adorable. So hard to pick which sticker to use when they're all so cute. For the next one, I'm using some green scrapbook paper. I also made one with Mr. Jin based on, who is my favorite character ever. The sticker wasn't printed that great, so part of his face got left behind. But don't worry, I fixed his face. I used some holographic washi tape, but it didn't look that great, so I ended up using a different one. So after you finish sticking your image inside the cap, seal everything with Mod Podge so nothing moves around after you add the resin. When you're ready to add the resin, measure equal amounts of hardener and resin and pour everything into one container. You're supposed to do double mixing according to the instructions, but uh, I kind of just skipped that part and just stirred for about 2 minutes. Make sure you cover your work area with something to protect it before you start pouring the resin, like newspaper because I got resin on my desk and it was such a pain to remove. I like to add my resin in layers so I can put some glitter and then add more glitter on top. You might get some air bubbles, so you can use a toothpick to pop them. I'm just using my pencil, but again, I wouldn't really recommend this unless you wipe your pencil really thoroughly afterwards because I can no longer get any lead to come out of my pencil because of the resin stuck on it. Also, try to wear gloves because your hands might get super sticky afterwards. 
Let your resin pieces sit for two days and try to put them under something to prevent dust from getting into them. You can paint the back of the bottle caps with some acrylic paint, but it's a little bit difficult and honestly I'm kind of lazy and don't mind the beer logos, so that's why I only painted about half. To make them into charms, you can glue gun an eye pin onto the back. You can also stick pieces of magnets on the back and you can use them to decorate your fridge or your lockers. I hope you guys try this because it's a pretty fun project and it's fun mainly because it's so simple and you don't need any molds. Um, if you do try this, make sure to tag me on Instagram and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!